we caught very nice cells. Then I re-entered SL here. We, we, you know, we've got that noted down. Previous highs over at 2685. Previous highs lows are 2673, which we caught. Previous high low touched, just wicked out above the body this time, just to trap out all the old sellers, which were in this position here at the 2660, which happened. Now we wicked. Now we should sell back off. Like I said, the previous high body we've touched. Now we're gonna descend back to 2630 today during NFP and probably 2600 during NFP. Yes, it's NFP. Come on, NFP today. Big sales happening, 2630, 2600, and then it's going back up. Liquidity grab, I'm telling everyone, I've been telling everyone since the day I started this challenge. The gym session is arms today. I need to recap. It's actually a mad one, hitting gym every single day. And I've got four legs, chest and shoulders, back, and then arms. So some sort of routine I've got going on. I keep forgetting what day is what. I think in the last two videos I've done, I thought I was a day behind. But I'm actually on day 18. I uploaded day 17 yesterday, which is actually to my editor. And I uploaded it this morning because I fell asleep and forgot to upload the thumbnail. <laughs> Yeah, big trades. Got to feed Leo the leopard. Got to feed Leo the leopard and then get moving. Agenda on today's hit the gym, sauna, abs, cardio. Get it in, get it done. Then haircut, trim, bosh. Every single week, get a trim. Make yourself feel good about yourself. That is a way to go. Maybe I'm going to do a weight check right now as well. See what weight I'm actually on um, because I haven't been weighing myself. But I think it's about time we start weighing ourselves so we can start seeing the decline uh, in body fat shredding off my skin, which would be good. But yeah, feeling good, feeling positive. Oh, oh, fucking this up. I'm really fucking this up. Oh, no. Oh, my God. I just want to go to bed. I've had the worst time now. Yeah, feeling good. Feeling good about myself. Day 18. That's 7, 14, 21. Nearly three weeks in. Fuck, man. Still got another, like, two months. One and a bit months, which, uh... Which, you know, it is what it is at the end of the day. If you, if you like my, my blinds, top. Top draw, they are. Top draw. Oh, no. Oh... I need a coffee. I need a coffee, man. Shit. It's gonna be a hard day, but let's get it done because God did not raise a quilt. Bosh! I don't know if I'm in that bad stage where like you're losing, oh fuck, wrong, wrong way. Ooh, not bad. 70.75 kg. Right. So I'm just, I need to try and get under 70, I guess. But, not bad. The way I can, the thing is, in the camera I can't really see it, but in in my eyes I can see I can see weight loss happening slowly, slowly but surely. Hopefully I'll get my hair cut and shave this off today, and then it'll, I'll look a bit leaner. But yeah, in this current situation, it's like it's coming, as you can see. Look, but. Seventy kg, we take that. <sighs> Just got into the gym. The G double M Y. No, that's wrong. Fuck. Um. All right. Anyway, yeah, gym session. Arm day today. Let's fucking go. Let's fucking go. I'm not gonna lie. I'm already uh, flagging. I'm flagging the step up. My legs are fucked from the five k run, and legs the previous day, which has now been two days. But what I'm gonna say to myself is. If I take today off the stepper, I'm still gonna get the walks in, still gonna get the the kilometers in. But tomorrow I'll do five to ten K. I said ten K is the target. We'll run a ten K tomorrow instead. Save the legs, run ten K tomorrow, bosh. I just wanna get a quick session, get in the sauna and then go get a trim if I'm honest with you. Look. But let's go, let's get this session in. Elbow still hurts today. Oh, it hurts quite a bit to be fair. I must have really fucked it up. I'm no pussy either. 
says the guy who moaned on it twice in the last two days. It's just a warm up set, and they're going to go in heavy, which is why I'm, I'm worried. It's the owl elbow here. Fucked it. Oh, there's nothing better than an arm pump, I swear. It just gets me fucking horny. Right, so just currently doing triceps right now. And the thing is with this challenge is it's just showing up every single day. It's not actually, you know, doing the workouts, yeah, they're great. You don't always have to go as heavy either. You can just, you can do lighter sessions some, some days and heavier sessions the next time you hit that muscle group as such. But it's just showing up every single day, telling yourself you're gonna do something and then doing it. And that's what you start to learn. I understand though, it is difficult. Like if you've got nine till fives and stuff like that, obviously it's hard, you know, you've got families or, responsibilities but if you don't and you've got a nine till five and then you just go home and playing video games then you need a fucking reality check don't get me wrong i love a video game that is not the issue with with things in life okay that's a good little release the video games it's just show up yourself and put it in otherwise you keep going on a downward downward spiral nothing is gonna grow or benefit you by doing that you're just getting worse and worse and worse and then you start hating yourself more and more so get in the workouts and try and enjoy it you know try and look at the every take every day as it comes don't look at like the longevity of the challenge don't go oh you know fucking hell we've got two months you don't even have to do the challenge do two days on one day off two days on one day off keep doing it keep showing up for yourself slowly but surely it will build you know the <clears throat> i've not i've not lost a dramatic amount of weight but obviously you know it's been two weeks three weeks that's not gonna happen you got to put the work in and then the results start to show you lose fat in loads of different areas you know you've got your face you've got your you've got your shoulders you've got your arms your legs you've got your stomach your chest your, your thighs you've got so many places where fat stores so don't just look at yourself and go all right you know i haven't seen the progress i want you're not really even doing it to get into shape. You're doing it for the mental stimulation. You're doing it to show up for yourself, to build the consistency, add the discipline into your life. And that is everyone needs to try and motivate themselves. Even if it's twice a week, three times a week, just get in some, some form of activity. It's hard at the start as well, but it gradually gets easier. And then hopefully it becomes sort of addicting to wanting to improve yourself. Everyone starts in a similar position everyone has their own issues in life everyone has their own problems you know we've all got our own story you know we're, we're our own main characters in our own in this fucking massive thing that floats in the galaxy called space but realistically speaking it's just you versus you and if you fucking lose to the mental side of that who whatever it is saying don't do that or pick the easy option or always going for dopamine spikes where what i mean by that is you know getting the fast food that's a dopamine spike because it makes you feel good in the moment but it it fucking makes you feel depressed when you look at yourself and you're fucking high blood pressure and you look like you're about to fucking have a heart attack any second and uh same with trading trading stressful very very stressful job very stressful putting out trades to not only your own money but other people's money on the line their futures and all that sort of stuff it's a very stressful industry and toxic one too let's not say that, let's add that in there but this is just getting time away shit i'm gonna fucking shit myself thing in the world the hardest thing in the world it like because you know the more you lose the harder it gets which is why when people are in incredible shape it's it's remarkable to even witness because it's not that you know they've got strict diets because that's part of it but 
is that they're strict for majority of the time. And if I'm honest, like, this is why I wanted to stop, you know, drinking and stuff like that, because you wake up feeling shit for the next day or two, mine's two days now, minimum, and you eat shit food the next day, sugar levels are low, you'll drink fizzy drinks, you just fucking self implode and like, even if you're clean throughout the week, you, you go in that day and then you don't go to the gym for like the next two days, you're just fucking storing the fat. And like, you stop drinking you, and stop having all the shit, your, your belly starts to not unswell. Like, we're, this is like two weeks in, three weeks in. Imagine in two months time where like, stomach's not swollen anymore for alcohol. Like you're pinching your skin, not, there's barely any fat comes off. Like it takes time, and that's why I wanted to do this on YouTube, document the whole thing because it's so it's gonna be so sick to watch the first day and then the seventy five last day. And who knows? I might continue it if you know the love and support's there, and you enjoy the daily content uploads and all this. Then I'll keep going. Wasn't the best session if I'm honest with you. I avoided the step off today just because my legs hurt and shit. Making up excuses really, but I'm gonna try and do a five to ten K run tomorrow. Well I'm definitely will do a five to ten K run tomorrow. So I've got that lined up. I have to conserve my energy, my muscles. I don't wanna go too over the top. But nevertheless, a session is a session. Was in the gym for about an hour doing arms. Obviously, I had to take mid shit, so let's just say about 45 minutes of actually working out. But got it done, got it dusted. A workout's a workout. It's about showing up and getting it done. It's not about how hard you really hit it as such. There's some days where you could get more motivation, some days where you feel like you can do heavier than others. But this is about building the consistency, the discipline and overcoming that mentality where it just says, don't even bother, like, at least I showed up. Burn some fat, hopefully, gain some muscle, or at least maintain the muscle, which is important when doing these challenges. And yeah, we're in a sauna, we get 20, 25 minutes in here, and then we go get a trim to make ourselves feel and look good. Good fucking start to the day. That's all I can say. We jumped in sales at 26.61 after closing for 3% this morning. Fingers crossed we can get at least 2% off this trade, which is a 40 pips. That's all we need. That's a two to one. Fingers crossed. Don't know what, what that is. Something's just come up there. Don't know what that is. But yeah, sauna's done, feeling good. Gym's done, feeling good. Now it's time to get a trim. Trim and a trim in somewhere called Troyer, which is a, a very nice place, which I might go to, who knows, but they do meat. Oh, quick. I'm gonna fucking shit myself. Not again. This is the last chance. I have one spot left for the funded. I will pass the challenge and then make payouts. We'll have full communication on Telegram. It's your last chance. Once you get funded and make payout, you get refunded the challenge fee as well. Last chance before NFP and also before funding pairs launches. So it's the last spot. Make sure to message me ASAP one hour before NFP. Gosh. Getting a trim right now with the barber. He's, he's ripping into me because he's <laughs> saying that I look like a superhero because of the guy in the comments, whoever commented <laughs> that. Appreciate that, but we're just gonna get skin, skin feed, baby. Come on. Friday night, we're gonna get boys, we're now to eat. Got a kiss with AP. <laughs> oh, here we are, look. Woo! Oh, wow. That Fucking hell. Nice, nice, nice. Nice. Woo! Nice. 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 Bosh, bosh. Oh, get in my fucking stomach. Get in my fucking stomach, you little dirty slut. NFP is about to start. Let's fucking go. NFP is about to start. We've got cells on. 
Can we smash take profit? Here we go. Boom! TP smash 5% in the free trading group and also platinum. We are done for the day. NFP smash the take profits. Kiaba!